Hello, Flawless Beauties! Welcome back to the channel! If you guys are new here, I am Astra and I hope you guys consider subscribing if you haven't. And if you guys are OG subscribers and families, well then, uh, welcome back! So from the title, you can see that there is a team wall. But I am off to a side because I have a specially invited guest. Let's uh, welcome Zaya! <laughs> if you guys don't know, this is my husband and I asked him to join me today because he too has some stuff from Timo and I know that there are more females actually purchasing Timo stuff and that's more saturated on the on YouTube than it is on men. So I was like, you know what babe, how about you join me showcasing your stuff so that the men can, you know, see what else is there for the men and then to the women, their wives here who has um, sons as well, who can buy for their husbands, so it only but makes sense, right? So, this is going to be a mixture, mostly travel series, but we also have some other things that we're going to throw in here first, before we actually get into the travel stuff. So yeah guys, stay good. Guys, so I'm gonna let Dario go first. So he's gonna start his portion and I'm gonna chime in eventually. Next question the bike, yeah, she has to do a little whippage to get into the bike. But um, from this poll, I actually did not realize that there were these many socks, but I bought um, some anklets for us. Um, there were like five pairs, each black, five pairs white. Mm -hmm. And they have this blue, yellow, and blue, red, and gray trimming on them actually. Mm -hmm. And uh, all of them actually have the word cotton on them. So you'll be able to know that they're actually regular cotton socks. I haven't tried them yet, but the quality feels good when they pull them. They feel, they feel as though they will do a stretch and they're actually be very comfortable. Mm -hmm. So I do recommend these. Definitely, I mean, and Dave will be sharing these because um, I. I don't need play five pairs of socks. When I saw the caption, it actually said um, play piece. So I actually clicked on black and white, not recognizing that I would have gotten five pairs of black and five pairs of white. I thought it would have been like a mixture of three, three black, three um, white, or three black, two white, whatever, three, whatever makes five. But um, I, I'm glad that we got them. We'll definitely be making use of them as you know we work out. I was looking to travel soon. Right, these are some boxers that I also got. These are four piece. So they come in blue. Let me show you these. If they come in red. This is a nice red as well. They come in black. Right, black. And they also come in gray. Mm -hmm. um, funny story is that when I bought them, I wanted to buy a large. But I bought them at extra large, I didn't realize that I actually clicked extra large. Um, tip, just make sure you check on your stuff before you hit order because sometimes you will not be able to send them back. Um, but when I tried this on, the yeah, extra large actually fit perfect. Um, it's not to say that I fat or anything, but yeah, fat. Um, I'm just kidding. Is, they actually fit very, very good and it was really appreciated, very appreciative of that. Right. Um, I know. If it's gonna do her stuff, she probably got way more than I do. Either ways, I do not. So, just simple jewelry. You guys know I can't hit Timo with all the accessories. Like, let us know what people are. So, all I got, nothing a lot, mind Mr. Man. All I got was some gold accessories. So, let me show you that. This is a pair of gold earrings and the um, chain to it. Then I got some gold, some other gold accessories, but this necklace is really long. Um, I was complaining at first. I was like, you know what? Just let it be. You never know. It might be something that you like. You will definitely find usage for it. Um, the, yes, the necklace is the gold version to the necklace that I actually have on. I have on the silver version to it. And this entire set is actually the gold version to the set that I have um, right now. You know, this chain is like really, really long. 
So I got um, this pretty necklace. I got the ring to it. I got a pair of earrings as well. Let me see if I can just put all this here so you guys can see it all at once. This is what they look like, guys. I really like this box. Um, this box chain looks really nice, huh? The gentleman ordered two. So I do have a necklace similar to this, but the only thing, mine is a bit bigger than this. So I have two of these, and they have the letter A on them. So let me show you what they look like. Very dainty and cute. Let me show you. I'll just hold it one for you, yeah, because they're both the same. Very, very cute. And you can choose whatever letters as well that you do prefer. And the stones are also um, on, in that A. So that is simply it. I'm done. Alright guys, so now that I'm finished with my little portion, we are going to get into what we ordered for our traveling. As you guys already know, summertime, persons are traveling. If you guys follow our channel, you already understand why we are traveling and around the time we will be traveling. So um, we wanted to get some things to assist with um, packing and so on and so forth. So I'm going to let Bim start. And I, we do have kind of similar things. So when he gets to something that is similar to what I have, I'm gonna chime in and, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna open up our box and our package together. So what do you have, babe? Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna start with this. Um, yeah, this is what everybody thinks. It's a bike. Huh. Um, it's a laptop bike. It's a bike for computers. Um, it's very, small but it's actually very handy you don't as a side you need a big bulky bike to walk in a little bit yeah. especially in the airport um uh, airport security and all that sort of stuff so um i have this bike plastic is still on as you can see i actually haven't looked at the bike or anything in the search yeah. so um i'm just gonna hold it up so you can see it open it up i'm gonna open it yeah open it up the hands Yes. Okay. So, I'm just going to show this. So inside here is actually you put your laptop mm -hmm. or computer and there's a safety harness for it. So you can actually keep it in place and for travel. Yes. Then there is the actual compartment here where you put like your phone and camera, whatever the case might be. And then there's a front pocket. The front pocket is this deep. Um, so like this deep here. So that will give you an idea of uh, how big the pocket is. And yeah, um, they thought it would be best to get one of these bikes. And I really like it so far. I definitely will be using it on our travels. It's sturdy, it feels good. It doesn't feel as good as one of um, I don't want to say it doesn't feel cheap. But it doesn't feel as good as one as soon as they put stuff in it. It's going to match up on anything you start. And you'll definitely be seeing this in our travel videos for sure. And I will definitely recommend this if you're traveling, even if you just need a bike to walk around with at times, and we, we can always get this bike. Alright, so I do have a bag. Let me get my bike. Oh, my bag is quite big. Bike. This, I, was, it, it, I wasn't expecting it to be this big. It is a duffel bag. Um, I got, I ordered black as well because my suitcase is pink and I, that pink is a hard pink to match things to because that is a very different pink. So I don't want to risk ordering a pink bag. That's just me, okay? I don't want to order a pink bag and the pinks don't match. That is a me, okay? If you are like that, you understand me. If it doesn't matter to you, then you don't understand. So this is what the bag is given when filled. Oh, it looks so clean, honestly speaking. So it looks like this. It has a section of compartment at the bottom. If you want, you can um, maybe store shoes, um, slippers, or whatever have you um, down bottom. And I, I don't mind the size of this at all because I am one to, I like to walk with um, excess clothes just in case the luggage gets lost or whatever. So I like to have them in my carry on. I don't mind having the excess room so I can have more stuff inside of my personal bag so we have this compartment on top right here it has this is what it looks like on the inside we have another section here zip compartment on this side so you can place stuff in here 
There's also me flip the bag. On this side, you have an other compartment where you can have probably like your phone or, you know, any things you want to quickly access, like tissue, lip gloss, lipstick, you know, how they do as girls. And then there is an extra strap. If you want to wear it over your shoulder, this is a shoulder strap. And it hooks here at the side. So, you can always just throw it over your shoulder if you want. Now, one of the reasons why this was advertised as a travel duffel bag is because it has this compartment here in the back. So, your um, suitcase handles will simply go up through here. And you don't have to worry about holding your bag. You just put it on top of your carry-on like this. Boom. And let her go. Good to go. As you can see, we have a sit here. You want to put anything in here, maybe your passport or whatever, whatever. So you can access that quick instead of having to go into the body of the bag. You have that as well. And the material seems quite waterproof. And this bag, I don't know, I don't want to say it is a sturdy because I've never used it before. And as you can see, it's a duffel bag, so it does like um, collapse a lot. So I really appreciate this bag because of this section here in the back, as well as the base um, underneath here, where you can probably put shoes or whatever have you underneath here, even like documents. If you know, if I don't have like liquid in so your bag, documents can also be placed underneath there as well. So yeah, that's this is my personal bag that I will be taking. And it reads, um, take you to see the world. This now, this is a pouch. Yeah, to so put different things in here. Um, but for me, I'll be putting my watches in here um, so that because I have I have the watches I'll let to carry with me. Mm -hmm. So I'll definitely be putting my watches in here. Mm -hmm. uh, my chains and um, bracelets will be going in this section here as well. Mm -hmm. um, so this is one other thing that I have as well. Okay, yeah, so, so for me, I have. This cute net! Okay, hold on. Look how big this is. This is like the size of my palm. So this is my jewelry organizer. Um, as you can see, it has a section above here where you can place your chains. Okay, set up it here. If I want, I can put earrings or rings right here as well. And, you know, whatever else I need to put in here. I am not a big ring wearer. So I don't necessarily think I'll be carrying like rings, but this part here can come out as well. So I've been wanting to put at least one watch in here whilst I wear the other silver and gold. Cause, you know, I don't think I'll be wearing anything outside of those two. I can always place one right here. So all my jewelry is going to be, all the jewelry I need to take with me is going to be compact. And when you do place your chains in this section right here, they have this area right here. That you can that the, the pendants or the length of the chain go hang into so it won't be uh, hanging over here and could possibly break or damage your stuff so this little teeny little cute net is definitely coming with me this is another um travel friendly piece as well okay. um i actually haven't decided what i'm going to put in here yet um but once you open it oh, oh crazy once you open it there's actually a part here that you probably can to put stuff in a match part, but not many. It's not cool. Um, then there is another section here that you can actually put stuff in. So, probably we put in, um, have no idea yet because I know we're packing a lot of stuff. So, uh, probably we put in more things in here. And then there's also a section underneath as well. That you can put more things in. So, it'll probably be, um, putting colognes or whatever in case maybe you're not sure. But as we start the pack, uh, as I start the pack, I guess so that you guys know like, how I use the different items so that you will know obviously then how to use them. Let's see, it, has a, it doesn't have a handle or anything. Oh, it's so masculine. Thanks. I like it. Okay. Alright, um, I have a pouch as well. So this is what mine looks like. This one comes in, I think, three other colors. Um, a tawny type of color, pink as well and i think i got off white and i let me give you an idea of let me see if we can find something to put in it to make it as big or as weighty as it could be so this one has gold hardware and um it has a compartment down below which i try to like open it up 
they can have it looking, you know, like it would look when I finish fill it out. So it has this compartment on bottom where you can like I put like my um, creams, lotions, all the even my like skincare stuff can go in here. There's also a compartment on top that is clear. Yeah. I can place whatever else I need to place in here as well. Cosmetics, if I want to separate my foundation and my face stuff, uh, my skincare, I can always do that. And inside of this bottom portion, let me take um, these out. Well, you have an idea of what it looks like. It has this area here that I can place like um, my makeup brushes or so on. Even if I have like dirties, keep the dirties on here and the clean ones above here. And the space in here is um, quite nice as well. And the material in here also looks as if it's not difficult to clean. But honestly, if it gets dirty, it doesn't look as if I, it's going to bother me, to be quite honest. So this is what it looks like. And it reads a joy, a pleasant trip. I really like it. it. Yeah, I like it. I really like it. It feels nice. Okay, let's see as well. See the back of the pack and all this. <laughs> so my next... Um, and here, no, it's not a bra. Um, but it's not a bra, it's actually an inflatable pillow, neck mm -hmm. pillow. Mm -hmm. So, I, I wouldn't inflate it now. Um, inflate it. Gosh. It feels good. I have a pink one. I didn't mind buying a pink one for me on this one. No, you don't need to do that. We do. Mm. Let me show you, sir. That's not how you do it. So, when you get your inflatable neck pillow, what you do, you seal this part here, so do it with me, seal it down, good, and then you open up this portion here, good, all you do is press. We should have probably done old school and the verses and the school thing and see what would have blown out faster. Keep pressing until it gets one. Cheetah, cheetah. And this feels so soft and velvety. When I saw it online, I really thought it would have just been like that hard plastic. So I was like kind of iffy about it. But it's very like soft and velvety. So when you're finished with it, you're so soft, but it's not hard. But anyways, when you're finished with it, you just seal this so that the ear doesn't escape. And you have these buttons here that you can clasp to secure it around your neck. There you go, and that's how you would wear it. But you know, it's actually not the correct way to wear that. You know, the correct way to wear it is the opposite way. Just, and that will prevent you from like, nodding forward and hurting yourself you're supposed to actually wear it like that when you are traveling really seriously being dramatic yeah but yeah though no, uh, you got the you got the gist of it yes and uh, i take it that when we are inflating it we just pull out this back part here go go daria uh-huh um, i would have probably done that faster than we can't this one but that would take you well anyways you figure it out. Whatever I'm a, you I'm a, I'm a well. And I'm a singer, and I ain't gonna be doing that. So when you're finished with it, you just remove all that air, fold her up, and drop it in your bag. Boom. You don't have to worry about this probably falling off your carry-on or anything like that. It, you know, I when I saw it, I was like, yes, put it in my cart. Mm-hmm. Oh, I keep my favorite one for a little later. Oh, I have something. Right, so these now, these are some really, some really good packing essentials. Just pull them up one by one. I don't know what these for. Let me see if I will eventually. Right, so I have some small bottles here. Um, definitely we'll be using these for like cologne. Mm mm, not um, using that for cologne. I no. bought, I bought some things to do different for cologne. Right, well, there you go. Um, right, so like these will be toothpaste, not toothpaste. Um, lotions, right, right, right. Lotions, gels, gels. Anything else? Anything else? 
need. So his set has um, one that you can pump, just like that. This is a spray bottom, which I do not. And this is a press bottle? Yeah, so press this one, sprays. yeah, you can dispense like this. And these are very, um, it's not, they're not like uh, soft either. Sorry, and then you have two. Probably to put in my um, like face powder in here, if anything. Face powder? Yeah. You want some Some product, some deep face powder, and I'm going use this in deep. Um, I really, really want to end up with it. Anyways, uh, that's why his, like, mine are pink. Yeah, there is a pink base. This, the, uh, these, um, this one, sorry, has just simply two bottles and uh, two of the same smaller ones that he has. Mm -hmm. He has the black version of these. Mm -hmm. These two little small jars. And this one has a spray bottle as well. And this one comes with a spatula. So if you want to go any creams or lotions or anything like that, you can always use a spatula and pop it in here. And also if I'm using any liquids, this one came with a funnel. So they made it quite, quite easy. So that is my pink mm -hmm. version. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank you, cheated. Wait. I got a spatula, but not but, the, um, not oh, the funnel thingy. But anyway, it's probably And mine comes with labels. <laughs> oh, you give me that book pass, that is like, eh? Moving on. So there's your favorite. Um, but I like your set better than my set. You got a whole pump thing and mine yeah. only got two two pink bottles. So this is actually the favorite, my most favorite um, that I bought. I actually came across these even before we, I think before we started talking about um, packing essentials. Oh. Um, and it's because a friend of mine actually recently got married and I saw him with his idea. Yeah, his wife actually had them. Mm -hmm. So I said, you know what I mean? Pose it in a bit. Well, not Mr. and Mrs. because there's a Mr. and Mrs. So we both got them. Mm -hmm. And they're actually his and hers um, passport holders. You know, I wanted the King and Queen, but the King and Queen didn't really hit enough for me. So these are actually a much more active representation. Same thing in and out. One is pink. One is, um, well, she holds the inside of this one, looks like, and you can see it side by side, and you'll be able to get an idea as to what you have. And what color is yours? Navy blue or black? What color is that? Mine is black. Um, like we mentioned before, keep in mind as we're doing this, that my, um, that my suitcases, my luggage, sorry, is black. They are black. Um, they will look all through you then. In the mini hall, we did a couple of videos back. And that is why we actually have the theme that we are shopping in. This came in force, actually. Thank you very much. These are earplugs. Um, there's some persons when they're playing the ears, the ears pop. My last year when we traveled, I had I had the same issue, but I think it was only on the first like all of our videos that I actually had it because I don't recall having it after. We we left Barbados and yeah. yeah. One those are for me. It's two is for you and two is for two. Two is for you and two is for me. Right. Two are for you and two um, are for me. Right. So there this is go. it. Um, this is what we got for the perfume. Correct. Um, let me just take the package so you can see it. Oh, it's like a lipstick. You're smaller than me. Mm -hmm. Oh, could Darren let like yours more? Um, this is so true. Right, so I guess I'll pick up the... No, I mean, oh, Alright, in order to get your perfume in here, all you have to simply do is uh, pump. You see that little bottom part of that? You will take off that spray portion of your... Um, yes, of your perfume um, bottle. And then that. you will go ahead and place this on top of your perfume bottle and just pump like that. And as it fills in here, you'll be able to see as it rises in here because there have, there's a window right here. Here. Yeah. Well, you're so dramatic. Sorry. Um, I, know, I, I honestly didn't, didn't I know. figure this out to be quite honest. So, bear with me, guys. And this is right. <clears throat> Technology is crazy. It's not. 
Anyways, guys, that's how you use it. That's why I always say never assume one and never assume that people know because they don't know everybody don't know everything, you know? So yeah, that's how you use it. I I I want a tiny one. These are um, the these are the uh huh luggage luggage uh huh <laughs> and all these are luggage covers, my love. Oh right, 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 oh. right, right. And there you know. So these are luggage covers. Oh. Right, as you can see. I mean, this open it up. This is the large one. So this is the large one. Your Bible has said it. Because it marks 28. And I have a set as well. And the other one is 22. 22. Okay, I think I bought a bigger one for me just in case. Oh, another one. You have another one. Like 22. Right. Yeah. So this one is the small one, obviously, is for the carry on. Yeah. And the bigger one is for the uh, our check luggage. Right. Yeah, so. so mm -hmm. Go ahead. Right, so it, it actually feels very good. Um, it smells good. Um, yeah, I'm very married to my wife, so I'm here and talking to Nana stuff. Is by like, default, you know, become one, to become one, yada yada yada, you know how we do this. Um, right, so it smells good, it feels sturdy, um, and yeah, to test it. So I'll probably give, give you two shots and test it with some water or something. Don't let him hear from back in my time, don't let him. Anyways, wait, right, so um, it feels good. Obviously, like they said, we'll be showing you guys these as we go along. Mm -hmm. uh, as we pack and stuff, I guess you can see in that because we're taking it along on this trip with us. Yeah. So you'll see how we Beach. are using these I things. Am. I don't know. And I will help pop in occasionally and show you guys um, how I am going along as well because I'm really excited for this thing currently. We got 30 days left before we travel again. Oh, daily, so, I hear a countdown. Yeah, so that's my stuff. These, I mainly wanted these because one of you guys already know that our luggage is new. If you didn't know, our luggage is new. And so I wanted to protect them as um, much as I possibly could. So I saw these, and I'm like, you know what, this is a good idea. Uh, hopefully they stay on, yeah, mm -hmm. during the throwing and tumbling that they'll be going through. And because I don't, I don't want my pink luggage to be scratched. I'm just sorry, this is just going to Yeah, and one other thing I was going to say last but not least, we have this. You can drop in the drawing to open it down. Oh, my bad. Right, and last but not least, I was wondering this way. And we have the like a skill. Um, so you guys know that. I think all weight is over 50 pounds. And that's the weight, could be wrong, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think uh, it's up to 50 pounds and then after 50 pounds you can put it all the way. So we actually bought this so we can keep ourselves in check and not have to pay any additional fees. Um, yeah, because we have been doing this for a while. Yeah, that's how we use it. Yeah, and then we have this one. Yeah, this is the same thing. Right, so this is the same thing. Yeah, look at Manuel here quick, blah 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 blah. Oh, just gonna yeah. say, wow, my husband reading Manuel, he blah 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 blah. blah, blah, blah. blah, blah, blah. Okay. But look, it's pretty straightforward. Wait, that was right. He needs a manual. I don't, I don't, just wait up this thing. So you will hook this up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so you will hook it onto your luggage like this, and fold this part here, and the number will pop up at the front. That is basically it. Hana. I didn't see anything popping up, so I ain't mean, no way to see so, why you don't trust manuals now. Babe, anyways, we will read the manual off, um, off of the yeah. off camera, and we will figure this out because there's nothing difficult. It's just to weigh, to weigh. Let me, let me just hurry and get it off the camera. Oh. It's just to weigh your luggage. All right, guys, and that is basically it. We will figure it out off camera. Oh, definitely will. And that brings us to the end of the video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoyed having my husband here as well to I showcase. definitely enjoyed it. It's good <laughs> you to be back. To show, back, where are you? To showcase to you guys <laughs> um, <laughs> some mail stuff and some traveling stuff. Anything else you want to add? Um, guys, shop team, that's all I say. There's nothing to run from. Um, in terms of clothes, I would just say to follow the 
size guide, but be guided based on some of the reviews that you'll get. That brings us to the end of the video. If you guys made it to the end, let us know by if there is there a suitcase. Actually, no, put an airplane in the comment section. Let me know you guys made it to the end of this video. And we'll see you guys in the next vlog from Barbados to you with all my love. Bye, guys. Don't forget to hit that circle button to subscribe to my channel. And here are two more of my videos. See you soon.